hello everyone so in this video we will publish our code to github in a very easy way so i will tell you very easy way so first of all you have to create your account i have already created my account in github so i will log in and uh, this is the my code my filter code i will open it with uh, vs code and uh, this code i will publish on uh, github so first of all create your account and log into github and uh, you have to install an extension in VS Code that is GitHub pull request. Pull request. So this one, you have to install this and uh, sign into your GitHub. First of all, you have to create your account if you don't have. So this is my account. I have login and. Uh, this extension has installed i will reload this load window so you have to download git and install in your system so i will download git search git for windows i have windows so i will install for windows so this one git downloads here so if you are using mac or linux so you have to install for that but i am using windows so i will download this for windows download for windows git has downloaded and i will install this and uh, next next so leave all these settings uh, and just do next next and uh, let's wait uh, until this uh, install So git has installed in my system and uh, again reload this uh, VS code. And this is my uh, GitHub account. So when you go on a source, co source control there will be a button. So this one publish to GitHub. So then your file will be uploaded to github and give it a name so i will leave this threads and uh, you can make it private or public i will choose public and uh, now you can see here my code is uh, uploading uh, to github so these, these are folders and files uh, are uploading on github so you can see here there will be a file a new project so this one you can see here threads and uh, i will click on this so you can see here these are all the folders and files that has been uploaded to github and you can also check these so there will be no any issue So you can see here how I uploaded my code on GitHub in a very easy way. So you can also make any changes and these changes will also be on GitHub. So that's all for today.